This is old Johnny C. He was always wanting to arm wrestle. Most of the time, I, he beat me, but I did beat him every now and then when he was having an off day. Just kids having fun. Um, but this word, inmate, which I put on this painting, Let's see what the day, I didn't say even sign this painting. I'll have to sign it. It's probably done during the COVID period. But this inmate that's written on here, that didn't, nobody said that until later. We didn't, we didn't say that word when, when we lived at Buckner's. Or at least I never heard, heard it. Uh, years later when YouTube came out people and you were going to Buckner sites they would mention that word well we were inmates you know at Buckner's and every now and then that word came up kept coming up and I was thinking well we didn't use that word at Buckner's I never felt like I was an inmate uh, we had total freedom at Buckner's. Um, Saturday afternoon, Sunday afternoon, we could do what we wanted, leave Buckner's, leave the campus, walk to downtown Dallas, which we did many times. It was seven miles one way and seven miles back. Long walk, but we did that. We could go roam in the forest, or if somebody came up and picked you up in a car, we're supposed to check in, but nobody always knew when people did that. But we had freedom. We could do what we wanted to. And for social occasions, it was hard for us to get out and go to a specific place because you'd have to have somebody taking you straight there. <clears throat> My last year in high school, uh, this girl, I think her name was Barbara L., was asking me if I would go uh, to the dance with her, and I kept saying, yes, I'll go to the dance, I'll go to the dance. She, we were in a homeroom. And then the day before, which was two or three weeks later, she said, are we going, still going to the dance? And I said, no, I, I don't think I can make it. And she started crying, and I didn't realize that she when she said the dance, she was talking about the prom. So I apologize, Barbara. I apologize right here and right now to you and to the whole world. I was immature and I, I didn't want to discuss that I lived at Buckner Orphan's home and probably your dad would have to rent me a tuxedo and pick me up and it could have been arranged if I had been adamant about you know sitting, pulling her aside and discussing it but I was I guess I wasn't capable of doing that or thinking it through then if I had it to do over again I would go with her even if I was in blue jeans But I apologize, and that's all I can do at this point. But I could have easily gotten out to go to the prom. It would have been a big, pretty big ordeal. Some of the people did go to the prom. I didn't. And 
years later, I realized it's a real big thing for girls, especially, if they didn't make it to the prom. So it must have been devastating, and I'm so sorry that that happened. But we can sort of make up for it, even in later years. This is just another painting where things get mixed up and things can be turned into something else if you're not careful. I want to thank everybody for coming to my page and watching this painting called Inmate.